when the doctor told our parents that I'm blind, first of all, they did not believe that I'm blind. My mother left me. If there were not the school, these students would wither away. They lead their life without dignity because baking is the only easy way of earning money. When I was admitted to this school, my condition was very bad. It was an unknown place to me. My friends extend their helpful hands to us. Most of the visually impaired children come from such families where they are very, very neglected. They want love, affection and sympathy from us. I get so much pleasure in this school. I am very much fond of singing and I always play on the harmonium. Any break time, our friends are very much fond of playing cricket. The bat and the stumps are made of iron. When it touches the iron stumps, it makes sounds and the ball runs with sound. Sometimes our teachers watch from far away and they're telling yes this is good and you have um, you have you have scored six runs uh, that means you know uh, he or she is encouraging me the students of this school are very good in uh, sports also for the first time they represented india in the World Olympic for the visually impaired. To teach the visually impaired children not an easier task. We have to have some sort of dedication, devotion. They want to know anything and everything. We try to provide the idea through scenes of touch. Majority of our students, after getting education, will be established as the teacher for the normal student. As they are neglected, we try to provide them love and affection at the same time training program to make them contributing to their family, to contributing to the society also. At the same time, we provide them safe shelter, which is very, very important to have. As blind girls are very, very neglected in their society, they have to face a lot of hurdles. I have many things to learn. I have many things to do. I have to overcome many places, many difficult things. I have to go forward to bring my success. All the students are brilliant. After studying, they are employed and are now well established. They are not burdened at all, but they are soldering the burden of their family.